hello everyone so this is what I'm going to do today so my game first starts from here that's the first checkpoint and here is the second checkpoint so when I start from here the character should be in an injured state where the character will be walking with an injured animation very slowly and once he go here drink water and sleep then after sleeping and in the next uh, wake up the character will be uh, healed and he will have the normal animations so here is the demo so this is when I first start the character will wake up like on the show and this is what happened to him now he is walking like this with the injured animation now, uh, now I have to go all the way to the pond and drink water and sleep so I will skip this part for now okay now I am back at the pond so now I am going to drink some water and sleep here right game saved so when I play the game again it starts from this checkpoint and I can walk normally I am completely healed all right so that's the part I am going to do today and this episode is sponsored by these generous patrons thank you very much for the support you guys are given me right so up to now we have worked on loading loading the last checkpoint but uh, we have a problem here the problem is if you remember uh, when I start from here the original plan was the character should have the injured walk and once he come here drink water and sleep then only he should restore his strength so that he should be able to walk again normally so I need to make the character uh, do the injured work when I start playing from this checkpoint if I play the game right now it starts from here that's because uh, I do have a save file let me go and delete it it should be in the saved save games right okay right now this is the first checkpoint we get the notification to get up press space to get up now I can stand up but he's not doing the injured walking he doing the normal walking so okay um, let's open the character and and let's open our character animation blueprint here we have this third person idle run oh, yeah this animation basically this animation blade space and also I have another injured blend space as well this one so 
let's drag and drop that plane space also here and let's create another boolean variable injured right and then we can plan process by bool and new I am going to use this is injured variable for this so if I am injured I should have this pause if not I should have this pause right and the final result should be like this okay now in the character interface Okay, um, uh, let's add the uh, function set injured input boolean. Right, and then Let's implement it, this function. What's this begin play? I need to clean this up. Otherwise, this will soon become unreadable. Okay. Right now, let's implement um, this set injured function here. And we need a way to communicate that to this uh, animation block print as well. Um, do I have a reference? No. Well, uh, let's go ahead and implement another interface VPI character animation oh wait I don't need any of these <laughs> this is because I duplicated that one um, right and let's set set injured again here with uh, Boolean. Oh. And then let's implement this character animation blueprint interface here in the character BPA third person animation. Right. Now in the event graph, I can implement set injured event with this set this like this and then here also I can get an instance.
set injured using PPI character animation. True. And also, let me collapse this. Um, here, let me check the default to walk in speed. Max walk speed is 600. Uh -huh. Right, we can set max walk. We need a reference here. to 50 no not 50 we should select this based on this injured value if it is a injured is true that means 50 otherwise 600 All right. Now, in this starting checkpoint, CP start, I need to. Yeah, I already have a reference to the player. interface call using the BPI character to draw right now let's see Right, now the character is working like this. Well, it would take some time to get to the water fountain. Well, I'll not stop recording this. Well, I am near the water pond. to go here and sleep all right now exit the game and if I play again well I am star uh, the game is started from the place where I slept and I can walk normally like a healthy person okay and one more thing here let's make something like this when I sleep and say okay 
here I don't have a reference to the player so get oh no but we do have a reference to this interacting character get a reference set injured to force so that after this I would be uh, even if I don't exit the game uh, my injured animation will be gone and I will be healed so right I'm not going to delete the save file and play from the beginning it will work I'm sure okay <laughs> that's uh, all for today So I'll stop this episode at this point. Right, and if you like to support my work, you can get the membership of the Patreon Club. Link would be in the description below. Also, the project files of this project will be available through Patreon page. And thanks for watching. See you in the next episode. Goodbye.